up everyone welcome back to vlogmas today is day 11 we're almost halfway through guys almost halfway through i just finished editing vlogmas day 10 um and as soon as it's done i'm going to upload it and schedule it for tomorrow morning today's saturday <sighs> And I have no idea what to eat. I haven't eaten breakfast. We already did like our whole morning thing. We went out to take Lenny for his walk. We basically already did everything. And I am so hungry. I have oatmeal. Yeah. I have oatmeal but no fruits. I don't have eggs. I don't have bread. I don't have like really anything for breakfast. And that's what I want right now. Like I want like a savory breakfast. Tyler is outside. Um mowing the lawn i want to go to aldi and get a couple of things i just want to get like eggs milk um some sourdough creamer i need laundry like laundry detergent so that i can finish our laundry but i don't want to go hungry because we all know that's a recipe for a disaster so i'm like should i just order something but it's like about to be lunchtime. it's 11 37. i would love like kava i could do tropical smoothie it's only 15 minutes and tropical smoothies yummy and they have i haven't had a smoothie in i don't even remember the last time i had a smoothie my um sister flew in to get her hair done so i think we might hang out with my cousins tonight like later on I'm not sure yet, but I don't really know what's the vibe for today. I don't really have plans. Your papa's outside? Yeah, he is. Um, we already took him for a walk, so I don't know why he's staring at me like that. I just want to eat so that I can go to the grocery store. I need, let me make a decision and I'll let you guys know what I end up getting. Has this ever happened to you guys? Like, I want food. I want food now. There's nothing for me to cook. But spending money on food, like Uber eating something, is just so expensive that I'm just like, I also don't want to do that. It's annoying because I have avocado, I have like a couple of things, but I don't have things to make one solid meal. Tyler planted my avocado tree like into the ground and it looks very happy to be in the ground. <laughs> I should have just ordered something. Oh, I'm annoying myself. I'm being chaotic. I'm making oatmeal. I just, I'm literally looking at the prices of ordering food and I'm like $20 for one Chipotle bowl or $18 for two tacos. Like with that, I could literally buy everything that I need from the store. So I'm like, no, I'm making oatmeal. I'm just doing the Quaker maple and brown sugar I'm doing two packets with some milk and that's it because I cannot be bothered to do anything else that I don't know why that flustered me so much and then as soon as I eat this I'm going to the grocery store because I need food. I need to make a list of what I'm going to buy so I don't forget and I follow, I follow. So milk, creamer, eggs, sourdough i'm gonna get some ground turkey just to have some tomato laundry detergent i think that's really it fruit fruits maybe some frozen chicken tender type things for like easy wraps I'm going to try to take you guys to Aldi, but it's Saturday, so I don't know how it's going to go. It's usually busy. 
but I need to go. And I'm on my last Olipop. So I need more of those. But maybe depending on what me and Tyler are gonna do later, maybe I can grab some with him. Oh my God, this bowl gets piping hot. I'm gonna eat this. Then we're gonna go to Aldi and do a compra. Just got out of the shower. I also got a new pair of denim. My best friend yesterday was at the Levi's store and so I had her pick up a pair for me. So I'll probably be wearing those today. But just gonna freshen up, put some of my regular everyday, the same shit I always do. It's probably pretty boring, but just using the same like five products. Um, I think we're gonna go to Armando's and use the rest of our gift card. I got that gift card from our landlord probably like four years ago. And we go to Armando's all the time, but we would always forget it. Um, so she had got us a $150 gift card and we used, I think we used it once. So we're gonna use it up for some lunch. And what sucks is that I just had oatmeal. Um, so I'm not exactly super hungry, which is okay. I can just eat something light and small, like an appetizer or something. It's more for the experience of just getting out and it's a beautiful day out. It's hot, but it's pretty out. I'm not sure what I'm gonna wear. I know I'm gonna wear the jeans, but I don't know with what because it's warm out. Like I could actually do my brown boots today with it and these new jeans with a white top or something, something simple. I really need to do my nails today too. I'm gonna do that today. I don't know what color I wanna do. It's still too early to do like a Christmas red. So, might do something else. figure out if I need to touch this up. My hair is so dirty that I just need to wash it is what I need to do. I feel like I need to touch this up. So I'll turn that on. These are Levi's 501 regulars, I think. There we go, original. Straight leg. Okay, so I'm wearing this top from Meshki. It's this little linen strapless top, the new jeans. I had to cuff them because they're long. And my Dior little slides, the hoops that I've been wearing pretty much every day. Huh? I have to clean these shoes. 
we got done on the washing machine. Okay, we're walking. It feels like it's summer. But there's wreaths and Christmas music playing. It's very weird. Um, but yeah, we're in our old neighborhood at our favorite Italian. Yeah, Oh shit! Wow, and that's the first, I think it was at this one the first time we ever went. So, here it is. Armando's College Park. This is the best Armando's. I think there's three locations. I say this every time we come here, but it's the best one. Do you want to sit outside or inside? Okay, so we're actually at the exact same table that we were last time we came here. Outside. It's really pretty out. Literally looks like a summer day. Um, he just ordered a Peroni, a beer, and I just ordered the, what is it called? Champagne Cosmo. Best martini I've ever had. Ever. It's so good. Got my favorite bevy. He got his Peroni. I'd never heard of Peronis until you got them one time. Sometime. Yeah. I don't remember where it was that you got it. I don't know if it was when we were in Italy. It was actually when we were in yeah. Capri, right? I went to get a beer and he was like, no, you should drink an Italian beer. I went to get German beer. It's was like, no, you can drink an Italian That was your first time you had one? Okay. Yeah, this martini is so good. The best martini for sure. I've ever, and I'm not even like into martinis, but this is definitely the best martini I've ever had. I ordered the lasagna, and I already know I'm not going to be able to eat it all, but it can be saved and reheated. And he ordered the margarita pizza, which is something we always get. Send it to Billy, the candle, the little Debbie candle. So good that his wife got him. So there's little Debbie's candles, guys. And what was that? An ad that you just got? Like a yeah. sponsored ad? They have like a zebra cake candle. So I feel like I have to get you one. And he doesn't even burn candles. No, because I don't want no sweet bakery smell in the house. I hate it. I'm not a you like that now. I used to hate it. I used to hate it, yeah. I feel like I've seen that place on be home on um like instagram or something before there's like a little home decor spot like right across the street right there there's a ton of little shops over here right i got the lasagna this is tyler's go-to and he got the margarita pizza which is also his go-to how is it it looks delicious it's super cheesy yeah. Tyler ordered some tiramisu. We got another round. I said I have no clothes on, but I do. Wedding cake was a tiramisu. Fun yeah, fact. I don't know if they might still do that. Mm. Made by a real Italian in Italy. No, I'll never get. I wish. I really wish I would have had somebody like behind the scenes getting video of all of that. Really, of like the chef in the kitchen. Like I remember walking into the kitchen and. Yeah. 
the chef making the burrata, like holding the mozzarella and twisting it and like pinching it off. And I was like, there is an Italian chef in our Airbnb on the side of a cliff in Italy making fresh balls of buffalo burrata. Like, what do you mean? What do you mean? Honestly, I don't regret the only thing I would have wished that we had at our wedding was a photographer. That's it. Everything else, and I wish we would have had some sort of like DJ situation, but even then it didn't even matter. Because everybody was just happy and lit and yeah, it didn't even matter. We just finished lunch. We are walking. God. Back to the car. <laughs> wow, I haven't used that word in a long time. Yeah, I feel fluffy. Do you feel fluffy? Yeah. We're walking really fast. A cute little Tommy Bahama. And the pizza place we went to the other day, Pizza Bruno, they just opened one right here. In College Park. They definitely did not have that here before. Ugh. Ugh, a Saturday lunch date? There's nothing better. Holy crap. Okay. I literally sat down, put the camera down, and we were already driving. I'm not slow. Love it. It's crazy though, like now that we're out of this area, how close the houses are to each other. Oh yeah. Everything's like super, I mean typical like downtown style. I mean I, would, I don't really care that it would have been so close. I just would have still preferred to have like all of our yard. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm, I wouldn't I'm give saying. up our backyard for anything. Yeah. Like our backyard is. back home it, every time I wear a strapless and I wear them a lot it always looks like I don't have clothes on but we are home such a lovely lunch date like I told Tyler like Saturday or Sunday lunch dates like I don't even care to go to dinner anymore let's go to lunch because it's still it's 252 we had a delicious meal we had a couple of drinks I had two and he had two literally perfect we still have the rest of the day Lenny's so happy that we're home. And it's just like, now I can get comfortable and just relax. And I definitely think that my cousins, cousins, plural, and my sister, I think we're all gonna hang out later, which is fun because we don't all get to get together. We don't all get to get together all the time because everybody lives kind of scattered. So when we do get to get all together, it's literally the best. So I'm about to get comfy just for like the meantime because I'm not gonna like get myself re-ready. I'm gonna be just like this and I'm gonna throw clothes on and be out the door. So I'm just gonna chill for a little bit, probably watch a little bit of YouTube, a little bit of TikTok. It is gorgeous outside. It's like the perfect summer day. If only summers here were beautiful because summers here are not beautiful. I know people that live in the cold weather are probably like, you're so lucky, it's summer. The summers here are just as bad as the winters in the north. Trust me, trust me. This type of weather, like when it's, let me see what the weather is right now. It's exactly 80 degrees. At night, it's gonna drop to the 60s. That is perfect weather. That's like northern summer. 80 degrees is like a cool day in Florida, okay? So anyways, I'm gonna change, get comfortable, and just chill for a little bit. 
I have lasagna left over, which Tyler will probably eat for dinner. So, my family is here. Oh, shit. My family is here and has been here for the last couple of hours. I just finished getting ready. I'm wearing this little shirt I made with these new Levi's I got and my Converse. There's my sister. You guys know her for the most part. She looks like a wet dog, so she's she's feeling impartial to, to, to video. Um, and we're about to leave to go out and meet up with our other cousin. So that is going to be the end of today's vlog. I don't know how much vlog footage I got, but I hope it was enough. And I will see you guys tomorrow.